Hey baby, we're going to be late today again. Come on. Hey baby. Lady, come on. Come on. Come on, baby. Oh my god. Sweetheart. Wake up. We're gonna be late today again. You know that? Oh my god. Lady, come here. Yeah, that's my girl. That's daddy girl. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, darling, let's go, let's go. Come on, baby. Be fast. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Come on, baby, please. I've not even had my bath yet. You know that. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There you go. Sit, sit. Come, come. Okay. Give me a minute, please. Okay. Uh, oh. Ooh. There we go. Yeah, we go. Ah, good. Come on, that's it. That's it. That's it right there. Are you okay? Come on, sweetheart. That is what available now. Oh, would you uh, prefer tea instead? Mommy used to serve me noodles. If that's what you want me to do, we both will be late for school. I've not even had my bath yet. Hmm. You know what, darling? On our way to your school, we get a nice delicacy for lunch, okay? Just manage this for me, please. Thank mm. you. Good. That's my girl. Mm, that is girl. Let me go and take my shower quick, okay? Thank you very much, baby. Come on, darling, let's go. Let's run, let's run. Just give me this. Come on, let's run. Oh, sir! 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 Get the gate, get the gate! Okay, sir. That's it. Michael, you need to. This morning has passed. Hi! 
After nine, nine picking see they go to school. Madam, but you no good though. If you no leave. But I tell you, if you're your sass, get this beautiful fellow. Mm, what is it? I for don't marry you. I for marry one, marry two if one no do me. Ah uh ah, -uh. which one be person all the time? Sass, sass. No be sure they do it. Tell you amo. Ah ah. If you're me get money rich like this, my wife die. I can't de carry pick. I be nani. Do not. Ah ah. So I go more. I got the sofa. The man the sofa. I swear. I love you, Lolo Cash, and nothing can make it go low. I know that you're a liar. <laughs> Father Lord, I've stuck this food in your hands, Father. You know me. I'll put myself too in your blood, Father. Make it a successful journey. Let me eat this food and be a successful journey, Father. Amen. Amen. I know that you liar. Oh. Mm. You're back so soon. Hmm? You're back so soon. I, mean, I am back so soon. Is it until my shoes chop off in this abuja you know that I've tried? So you, you have just come, come down, man. Come down. You and this your your hot temper. Eh? You. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You know, the thing is, you and I know that work is very, you know, hard to, to get, you know? You put in more, uh, uh, put in extra efforts. Eh? I mean, push hard. You are very stupid. Victor, you are very stupid. Are you not a man? Are you not a man, Victor? You are 26. Go out there and hustle like your mates. I know come this left to cross over for you. You didn't hear me? This is see, 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 what? Since you are, you are a graduate. Me, I'm, I'm still in, in school. How do you expect me to go pick up the job? Besides, I, I still do small, small, you know, little little jobs here and there to, to, to support. You know? Victor, I try. I try my best. I wake up every day and go under the scorching sun in search of job. There are no jobs anywhere. I come back, not even with one person saying, come back tomorrow. I'm tired. I am. Just can't. That means, that means we that we are in school, there's no hope for us. There's no hope. Because anytime a person wants to graduate, you see this excitement, but as I, it is now I'm scared. I'm scared to graduate. Because I'll, I'll graduate now and I'll join this long queue of jobless people. You know? Mm? No, I mean, no, not, not. Well, as bad as it sounds, you're making sense. This country is not easy. It's not. I'm tired for today. Tomorrow I continue. It's not even as if I have a choice. Please, what is inside there? Do you have uh, it's one cup of one, the last cup of rice that I cooked I cooked alone. Victor, even if it's half cup, we'll manage it together. We will. I did not ask you the size of the, 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 the thing inside the pot. Go and, bring, go and bring spoon. Let's eat together. This is it's one cup. 
I hope you wash the rice before cooking it. Huh? It's one cup. Let me. As big as you are, your sister is one cup. It's supposed to be fasting. Dad, you need a house help. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I already told you that is not an option. But we have no other options, Dad. Then we continue to manage with what we have. I can't just risk it leaving you with some stranger all in the name of a nursemaid. But we need a nursemaid, Dad. My classmates always mock me because I come late to school. And I also want a good breakfast. Henceforth, I wake up even before the clock. Okay? Much earlier. Is that okay? That's what you said the last time. But I'm trying, baby. I'm trying. Am I not trying? Now you're making me to miss your mom. Sweetheart, I've always kicked against nursemaid, house help, nanny you, because they do terrible and horrible, unimaginable things to children, and I don't want you in that position. Okay? I'm scared, Dad. You scared? No. Why? Wow, you shouldn't be scared. Why? Why would you be scared? That is always here for you. Mm -hmm. Don't have to be scared, baby. I'm always here for you, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, you know what we're going to do? We are going to get a nursemaid. But we have to be careful not to get a bad one. Okay? Mm -hmm. Back it up. Open, open, close the door. Yeah. Good day. Uh huh. Good day. Yes, what please. I I'm interested in the vacancy. Oh, the vacancy. Yes. No, it's not for people like you. The vacancy is a nurse maid. It's not nurse. It's the maid. Yeah, nanny. 
Nani, so it's not for people like you, eh? I'm aware. You, you don't understand. It is not an office work. It is a nanny, nanny work. That is where you come, you take care of baby, you cook, you take her to school. I said around. I am aware. Let me in already. Excuse me. You can't shine eye. Hey? My sister is not for you. I said it's not for you. This is a nanny work. It's not office work. They shy, you take, who they shine eye for? You say you are aware, you are aware. No, come here, come shy eye from you. You know what? Do you know who owns this house? You know what than my brother? It is, they see me on one side. Please, but, but. excuse me. Don't worry. I said this place. Not for you. Hey, hey, what, what, what's going on here? Uh, uh, sorry, sir. Huh? I was telling her that this place is not, there is no office job here. That what we needed is a, 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 a nanny. And she, she was trying to push me a whole uh, uh, CSO. Yeah. Sir, I, 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 I saw the vacancy, so I'm, I'm interested. I, I want the job, sir. Okay, the interview is 10 a.m. on Saturday morning, okay? Be here. Thank you, sir. No, they smile. Go, go. Okay, good day. You are pushing us ass. Everybody wants to come and show me power. Let me see you on Saturday. Mm -mm 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 -mm. You don't know how much they are paying you? Uh, I don't know. But I think it will be something good. You don't know? Wasted. You don't want I've wasted my energy now. What is that? If I have, have hit my back taxi move. All this one now. <laughs> you have made what? <laughs> So what was all this excitement all about? Well, I have faith in this one. See this one? I have faith in it. The interview is on Saturday. Sorry? Saturday. This Saturday. This Saturday. Yes. Uh, wait, wait, wait. What, what, what company does interviews on Saturday? On a weekend? Victor, it is not a company job. There's a vacancy for a nanny. Jesus. Sis, after eh? how many years in the university you settled down for a nanny? It's over. Hey, 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 no, 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 Victor, Victor, Victor. Victor. It's over. Victor. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. You, of all people, should know my struggle of trying to get a job. Don't even try to talk me out of this one. Ah, don't oh. You see this job? I I can see that I may be any more than this uh, white scholar job people. My pay may be high. Sis, do you think a nanny job will pay more than a company job? You know, if, if you if you are telling me that you are going to manage the nanny for for a time. Ah, my brother, there is nothing to manage. There is nothing to manage. Hey! If you see this house, mm -hmm. hey, Victor, if you see house, it's like a castle. Come on, look at the man now. He looks so wealthy. <laughs> you know what? I strongly believe that luck is shining on me already. <laughs> we thank God, though. Yes, sir. Thank God. thank God for me, my brother. <laughs> but sis, you see. You know how stressful all this taking care of a child is. And you, you know, you, you laugh a lot. But your temper is very, you are a short-tempered person. Your last experience in Auntie Ijoma's case ended up very, very badly. I know that's what you will say. I know it's what you will say. But listen, Auntie Ijoma's kids, they have zero manners. Mannerless children. But see this one. I know that it is not going to be like the previous. <laughs> because rich men children. Oh, they don't behave anyhow. I I I they are polished. I know. I, I was told because of your hot temper the the Auntie Joma's children got diarrhea. I wasn't the one that gave them diarrhea. I was not the one that gave them diarrhea. Are you sure? Victor, huh? pray for me. Pray. Pray for me to get this job. 
so that I can be helping you with your small, small school things. That's very important. So, so you have to pray. Um, I says, um, you have um, to pray. Um, I'll be praying. I'll be praying. And also fast. Because there's the many food you have to eat alone. Not now. Not now. So your CV says you graduated from linguistics, right? Yes, sir. Good. Yeah, take this. That's your terms of reference, and I would love you to go through it thoroughly. It's a living job. Exactly. You cannot be taking care of my daughter from your house. Your terms of reference explains it all. So, are you game for the job? Uh, yes, sir. I'll, I'll take the job, sir. Good. Good. So you will be placed on probation for two months until my daughter is comfortable with you. Your probationary salary will be 150,000. Of course, you don't have to feed yourself. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Also, there are some do's and don'ts contained in that document in your hand. So I would appreciate it if you read it thoroughly so you don't discipline my child by yelling or hitting on her. I would appreciate if you read your terms of reference thoroughly to avoid you being fired or arrested. No problem, sir. I'll make sure I read it thoroughly. Good. So, uh, we also have to do your medical checkup. I hope you don't mind. It's fine, sir. Great. But I think we're all good to go. Ah, uh, one last thing. There is no way I can trust my daughter with you without me knowing your place. I would like to know where you live. <sighs> no problem, sir. Please sit, sir. Thanks. Uh, that won't be necessary for now. Uh, we'll be leaving shortly. Uh, uh, Lily, would you like to drink something? I. No, that's okay. That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh. I would like to ask you a question. Do you live here all alone? Um, no, sir. I live with my brother. Your brother? Yes, sir. That's good. At least he's above 18 years, so he could be arrested in case you disappear with my daughter. <laughs> nah, I was just kidding. <laughs> <clears throat> so you could actually start on Sunday evening 
lady has to go to school on Monday morning, okay? That's fine, sir. Okay. Do you have any question? Uh, none for now. Maybe by Sunday I'll have questions. Okay then, uh, we'll leave it shortly, okay? Take care of yourself. Uh, so, should I...? No, but don't worry. Uh, we'll find out where we'll not get lost. Okay, sir. All right. Um, it's nice seeing your place. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Welcome. Thank Let's you. Go. Bye, sir. Bye. I think she's poor. Oops. Sweetheart, do not refer to anyone as such. I might like her. My teacher says good to treat poor people nicely. Lily, what is the problem? I just told you do not refer to anyone as poor. Sorry, Dad. That's okay. So she'll drop me at school henceforth. Hmm. That, yeah, sometimes, I guess. But for now, she'll get you ready for school and I'll drop you off. And while she's getting you ready for school, I'll we get myself ready for work so we don't get late anymore. At least you don't have to go to work with morning bread. Oh my God. <laughs> Lily, I don't. I can't believe you just said that. Well, so, so, what are you trying to do? Shade your father? Huh? And I can't have a good breakfast before school. Oh my God! So, what are you trying to say that I've not been taking care of you all this while? Now I'm seriously offended. Hmm. Dad, I didn't say that. No, I'm offended. I am seriously offended. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 you know, it's good though, it's good though, you know, at least for, for the start. <laughs> I told you, yeah. and I get to eat good food. Yeah. I won't spend money on transportation. Yeah. In fact, you're going to be the only reason I have to spend from my salary. Uh, but sis, that will not stop you from having your own savings, you know? Mm, I know, right? <laughs> anyway, don't bill me too much, too. You know yourself. No. Don't be me. Use your conscience, though. No. Use your conscience. I'm a hustler. I'm a hustler. Uh. I'm, a, I'm a hustler. Oh, uh, we know. I'm a hustler. We know. So, I'm Easy. <laughs> we know. Anyway, I hope you can cope on your own, right? Uh, why not? I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not a small boy. I'm a big boy now. 26 years. In fact, I can't even wait for you to go so that I can live on my own. Mm. Mm. I know. You think I don't really have girlfriends? Uh, I know since now that I'm leaving you just be bringing them in one after the other I don't know. anyway I hope you know relationships are for the rich men you know that right yeah since the girls they are the one chasing me they just want me to kill their god you know hey, I'm so so happy Victor, for you Victor Victor you know Victor that, don't give any girl below. no we're not don't worry I'm fine I'm just be fine <laughs> But anyways, I'm I'm happy for you. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm so so happy for you. You know, my only prayer is that that kid will not pose as a challenge for you. You know, like how uh, Auntie's children did. Auntie's children, they were stubborn. Victor, Lily looks so peaceful. I'm very sure I can deal with her. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. And uh, what about the boss? You know, he's a single dad, and you'll be living in the same compound with him. I hope he's not going to do you. S you know, you know what I mean. No sexual advances at you. You know, <laughs> Victor. That man is so handsome, attractive physique, with dashing confidence. He seemed to care so much about his daughter Lily, and that means any woman in his life. Will be enjoying him, trust me. <laughs> Sis, what, what are you talking about? Nothing. Good night. <laughs> night, night. 
<laughs> that's the that's the painful part in life, oh. mm. when you know somebody is going to crave the garden of your sister. Mm. But you know what? I said no, nothing. Let's sleep. Good night. Last night. Mm. Okay, so this is your space. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, sir. It looks extremely beautiful. I'm glad you like it. I love it. <laughs> yeah. That's the key to the main entrance of the house. Okay, sir. Lady in school starts at 7 a.m. and I will drop her off. And I would love you to pick her up at 4 p.m. Litness would not be tolerated. Sure, sir. Sure. Another thing I want you to understand. My daughter is all I've got. Laying your finger on her is something that I will not tolerate. So I would appreciate if you look after her with your whole heart. Sir, I will. I will take care of her like she's mine. Thank you very much. So the result for your routine checkup will be out sometime this week. I hope there's nothing to worry about. <laughs> I believe there will be none, sir. Good. I will text you the school address and also inform the teachers that you will be picking leading up from school henceforth. That's fine. Great. Make yourself comfortable. Thank you, sir. Great. Um, sorry, sir. Please, what would Lily be having for breakfast tomorrow? No, this would do. But you can also ask her what she wants to take to school for lunch. Maybe later tonight. Okay, sir. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Someone is all set and ready for school. <laughs> okay, so eat fast and let's go. You know we have to get your lunch, right? And so they already made me lunch. Oops, I almost forgot. <laughs> Good morning, sir. Good morning, okay. I packed some food for you for lunch. See, your lunch box. Really? Wow. You must have woken up very early to do this. <laughs> Thank you so much, okay? You're welcome, sir. But honestly, you shouldn't bother about me. Yeah, I'm paying you to take care of Lily. Uh, sir, it's nothing. It's nothing at all. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome, sir. Okay, sweetheart, so um, I just whipped on you. Uh, still have enough time. Come. Okay, I hope you like it. Mm -hmm. So you finally get to eat your noodles, right? Yes. <laughs> Good morning. 
Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, you see, uh, I say make I beg you for waiting up for the first time when you will see me. No be my real self. You understand? The man or sass, he be better person. But that day I be the rook say, fine girl like you, no fee just come do nanny. And I don't mean to, you know, understand what I mean. Well, yes. that was not in your place to decide. I, I almost lost this job because of you. I hope you know that. Uh, yes. Now I make I say, make I beg you. May you find little this thing for your heart. Stay forgive me. You understand, huh? Uh -huh. Uh, you see, you get, you get some better, better smell away from inside. They, they come meet me, so I say, make I know whether make I bring plates. So you go. Hey! <laughs> hey! Yes, uh, hey! <laughs> hey! <laughs> hey! Hey. No wonder. No wonder you suddenly remembered to come and apologize. Oh, yes, you are right. <laughs> well, you. sorry to disappoint you. I didn't have you in mind when I was making my meal. I, I don't understand. Sorry, it's, hello. Um, <laughs> Me, hello. No, verse. Uh, you see, <clears throat> no, uh, you see, and our forgiveness, I still ask. I know say you see the verse, all the anger with your body, just come on them, forget them. Forgive and forgive him. You understand that beg no verse. You see, ever since Madame leave us go heaven. Huh? Now only bye bye with the biting, so and you know say us oh, I know to get money. So my man she wrote they down there where they sell food where they buy, they push me. I make I never fat. I beg, forgive your little boy and help me with uh, this thing. <laughs> well, Osas. Oh, the food has finished. By the way, I was never employed to come and feed you. Ah! Oh, Sass! Oh, Sass, you don't suffer. Mm-hmm. Oh, Sass, you don't suffer. Despite your swaggerish self, in your full regalia as a CSO of this whole mansion. Ordinary nanny. Nanny daddy. Aunt Olga, does that mean I also have a personal guardian angel? Of course! We all have our personal guardian angel. Okay? <laughs> Don't worry. Tonight, I will tell you more about guardian angels. But for now, allow me be your early guardian angel. Okay? So tell me, were you giving any assignment today? Mm-hmm. Almost in all of the subjects. Oops. That means we have a lot of work to do. Don't worry. I'll help you with them, okay? Well, you will. Mm-hmm. My dad never has time to do it, so I do it all alone. Okay, don't worry. That is why I am here now. I am here anytime, any day you will need me, okay? Thank you, Auntie Ellie. You're welcome. Just then, the little girl felt a touch on her face. She opened her eyes. Guess what she saw? She saw a lamb. Standing by her door, she stood up, followed the lamb as they ran into the kitchen. When she got to the kitchen, she saw that her mother had forgotten to turn off the gas. She quickly turned off the gas and then turned around. Boom! The lamb was nowhere to be found. The lamb was the angel, right? Yes. And the angel saved the house from getting burnt that night. Wow, that means angels are superheroes. Um, you can say that too. <laughs> and Spaghetti is a beautiful story. Can you tell me another one? Not tonight. 
It's past your bedtime. So you go to bed and I'll tell another one tomorrow night. Okay? okay. Can I come to bed? Okay. Yes. Bella. Yogi loves you, okay? <laughs> Good evening, sir. Good evening. I can see you two are getting along. That's nice. Thank you, sir. How was work? Uh, work was fine. Very fine. Here. As a result, everything is okay. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Okay then. Sir, um, is there anything I can help you with? No, not for now. I'll be fine. Okay. Good night. Good night, sir. Mm -hmm. He's just so handsome. His lips, the way he blinks his eye. Oh, I love him already. I'm very sure my being here was fit. Oh my goodness. I cannot. I cannot wait for him to fall in love with me. And then we get married and be one big family. <laughs> <laughs> and then I will be the queen of this And the mother to the little sweet Lily. Daddy. Hey, baby. Look at you. Your new hairstyle is so lovely. Auntie Oge made it for me. Really? How come she didn't take you to the salon? She said we could get snacks with the money. Look at she got me. Mm -hmm. You and your nanny are really getting along. And that's good. She treats me nicely and I like her very much. <laughs> is that so? Yes. She's my guardian angel. Really? Yes. Guardian angels protect and take care of people. That's what Aunt Oge does for me. <sighs> well, I see. Okay, darling, uh, why don't you run? Mm, go and do cartoons and get along with your nanny, okay? Daddy has got a lot of work to finish here. Okay. All right? Oh! <laughs> Thank you very much. Bye, Daddy. Bye, baby. Get along with your nanny. I know.
nuestro firma. Ah, decline again. Let's try again. I've done that twice, man. So maybe you pay with card or It's cash. possibly network. Can you try again? Do you want me to spoil the machine? There's nothing I can do, man. Or maybe you should go and return the items. What is wrong with you, young man? Why be rude to a young lady? Maybe you thought customer service? How much is the bill? Oh, um, no, please don't worry. Um, I'll just go use the ATM outside. Uh, Thank I, you very much. I, I insist. Yeah. No, please yeah. don't. Thank you. No, don't. Yeah. Your piece. Sorry, your pin. Thank you. So your pin. Okay. Yeah. All right. Hello, sir. Yeah. Yes. Oh, good. Excuse me. Oh, hey, hi. Hi. I'm Kelly. I'm Matilda. Nice to meet you, Matilda. I'm same here. Uh, I forgot to say thank you back there. Thank you very much. Ah, don't mention. <laughs> okay. I uh, I would like to be your friend. I hope you don't mind. Oh, why? Sure. Okay. So, uh, what are you still doing here? Is oh, a car uh, around? Yeah, I'm waiting for my ride, actually. You're waiting for your ride? Mm-hmm. Ha. You have a ride right here, so can I give you a lift? <laughs> sure, thank you. <laughs> Come on, let's go, then. Good. Come. Still here? Yes. I had to put Lily to bed. Oh. Yes. That's nice. You're actually doing a great job. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Um, sir? Yeah? Is your anything you would like me to do for you? No, not at all. I'm fine. I'm very fine, okay? And okay, I would like you to know that you're purposely here for a lady, okay? Don't add my stress to it, okay? Fine, don't worry about it. <coughs> Okay, sir. Okay. Good night. Okay, okay. Good night. Um, I'm, I'm just saying, Sarah. Are you very sure? There's nothing I need to do for you. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm. I'm very sure there's nothing I want you to do for me. Absolutely nothing. Okay. Why don't you take the wine to the fridge for me? Oh, the wine? Yeah. Okay. The wine. Yeah. Uh, the bottle? Yeah, yeah. The, the bottle, actually. Are you sure? Just the bottle? 
No, 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 no. This is this that this is fine. Man. It's fine with me. It's <laughs> crazy. Oh, you go watch it. So much. You want some more? Oh, sure. Yeah, maybe that to do. No. Uh, that's okay. That's so, 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 oh, sure, 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 sure. That's very okay. That's so okay. I mean, okay. Yeah, it's okay. And I mean, okay. It's okay, yeah. <laughs> Thanks. It's okay. You can't be saying that. <laughs> Take. Uh, oh, please so, manage it, eh? Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Oh, because you want to count it. This is, this is, you have been trying for me. God bless you. God bless you. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> what? Mm. <laughs> hey, see the way you are looking pretty. Yeah, you have been added more weight. <laughs> I know, right? I mean, good food, mm. good environment, peace of mind. You don't just spell less. A condition 24 <laughs> See, if I graduate, eh? If I graduate and I don't get any work and I get this kind of job, I will thank God Almighty. <laughs> you. you know, I, I almost talked you out of this job. Hmm. You are eating. <laughs> See bed, Oxford bed. <laughs> eating food 24-7. You eat and sleep. Victor, hmm? I am worried. What's, what's the problem? My boss. He doesn't even notice me. Your boss doesn't even notice you? Yes. Let me thank God Almighty. Since now, oh God Almighty, that we thank that. Because most men, most men, once they see that you, you are very beautiful, you have the oak, they will start touching you. Pram, 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 they will start touching you. Thank God that your boss sees you as like an elephant now. <laughs> Do you understand? What, what's your, I'm saying? Victor, hmm? I want him to see me. Oh. He don't get it. I will be so lucky to be married to a man like him. Oh. Take a look at it now. Eh? He's handsome. He's caring. And then, to crown it all, he's rich. Sis, are you in love with your boss? Yes. As a matter of fact, I have been in love with him from the very first day I set my eyes on him. Huh. Now, wow. Sis, sis. I know I'm, a, I'm your little brother, but please, just take this little thing I want to say. Says, please, focus. Focus in this life. This small job that you have gotten, please, we are, we are, we are managing. Don't let your feelings count across things. You said this man hardly notices you. Meaning, you know, he doesn't see you. He, he sees you like an elephant. Forget it. The, feelings is, 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 the feeling is not mutual. Are you mad? No, like, are you stupid? Oh. Are you, you, you just open your mouth, wah, and vomit rubbish. You are the one who told me. What makes you think the feeling is not mutual? Pastor, you are the one who told me now that you, he hardly notices you. And so, does that mean the feeling is not mutual? <sighs> well, I have this feeling that, you know, he's still trying to get over his late wife. Idiot. 
instead of you to encourage me and pray hard for your sister that this thing works. As if you will not benefit if it works. Hmm? She says, I'm not trying to upset you. I'm just trying to tell you the truth. That's all. Oh, God, true talker. Oh, yeah, come on, be going. Come on, be going. It's okay. You... I need to pick you from school. Oh, yeah. Okay. But see, see. You know what? Give me back my money. Sorry? I said my money. You're very stupid. No, I didn't. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's okay. I'm sorry. I didn't okay, 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 you know. Please, guess your hot temper now. You're something you have to control. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm going, I'm going. I'm going. Stupid boy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Rubbish. And so I can do my brother is in assignment. And okay. What? Sorry, I I I I, I, I yelled at you, okay? My mind was far away. What are you saying? I'm doing my brother reason assignments. Oh, good girl. Let me see. Um, Lily. Lily. Do you know who that is talking to? Mm-mm. <laughs> of course. <laughs> of course, you won't know. Okay, so... Where are we? Um... Wow! So... The grandma said to the little girl, why don't you go to the stream with this? Hey guys. Good evening, sir. Good evening, okay. Hmm. <laughs> uh, okay, you can have some rest. I, I'll take it off from here. Oh, okay, sir. Lee, good night, okay? Good night, Santi, okay. Good night. <laughs> <laughs> Good night, sir. Good night, okay. So, how is my pretty little angel doing? Fine, Daddy. You sure you're fine? Mm-hmm. Do you have something to say to Daddy? Mm-mm. Are you sure? Mm-hmm. Well, um... Daddy has something to say to you. I met a friend. Her name is Matilda. Is she a girlfriend? <laughs> Where did you get that from? Um, well, she's a close friend. Yeah, and I'm very sure you will like her. Is she beautiful? Absolutely beautiful. When I showed her your picture and she already likes you. Really? Yeah. I like her too. You get to meet her very soon. She will be coming over the weekend to spend some time with us. Wow, I like that. <laughs> At least let's have a guest in this house for once. Hmm? Yeah. Right? So, ah, uh, past your bedtime. You need to catch some sleep. It's already late. Daddy, will you yeah. tell me a story just like Auntie Ege used to do for me? Um, yeah, why not? Okay, so, <clears throat> Teddy Bear, good. Once upon a time, there lived this beautiful princess.
Hey, uh, Oge. Okay. Sir? I, I need a little favor from you. I'll be expecting a guest here today, so I need you to tidy up the house and prepare a delicious meal. Here. But, sir, I don't understand what the money is for. We have enough ingredients in the house for food. I'm fully aware this is not part of your duties, so I have to pay you for it. I know how stressful it can be. So I'm not asking you to pay me for it. But I insist. Anyone who provides service must be paid. Here. Okay. Thank you. Are you okay? Yeah, yes, sir. Sure, I'm fine. You sure? Yes, sir, I'm sure. Okay, have a wonderful day then. Thank you, sir. You too. Sweeter. When money enter, love is sweeter. <laughs> God, don't answer my prayer. Be like, say, finally, I got on for a woman where you go marry. <laughs> if this becomes the truth, God, I will give you one goat. Because that idiot, that nanny where they did, now kick, I go take him out. He can't do nanny, they brag. Now, woman, where you be, madam, don't come. Taking care of him and his daughter, and he goes to bring a girl from nowhere. He doesn't even know what's best for him. I won't allow any stupid girl come here to take my place. And that girl, 
She thinks she can come from nowhere to reap where she did not sow. A bee? No way. I will make this place unbearable for her until she packs her stuff and leaves this place. So, Daddy brought home a stepmother for you? But that isn't my married to Auntie Matilda yet. Let her pray he does not marry her. Because she looks very wicked. And I have this feeling she wouldn't treat you nicely. Yes, darling. You didn't see the way she did her face when she hugged you yesterday? She doesn't like you one bit. She was only pretending because your father was there. Well, also, you don't know. She would only act nicely to you when your dad is there. But I didn't do anything wrong. And that says I'm a good girl. Oh, darling. Of course you're a good girl. It's not you, okay? It's her. She is a bad woman. She would always pretend when your father is there. But don't worry. I am here for you. I will make sure she does not harm you at all. I will protect you against her, okay? And that's why you're my guardian angel. <laughs> yes, baby. I am your guardian angel. Uh, really? I want you to make me a promise. Promise you're not going to tell daddy about this. Why? Because if you tell daddy, daddy will tell her and she will make daddy send me away. Or would you want your guardian angel away from here? Good. So promise not to tell daddy. Promise. Promise. Good girl. You know that I love you so much, right? Yes. Okay, I love you too. Okay. And I promise to bring something to you when I come pick you from school later today. Alright? Okay. So let's get going. Good girl. Do you want to marry her? What? Do you want to marry Auntie Matilda? Mm, not like that. When you marry her, will you stop loving me? Hell no, darling. Why would I stop loving you? Where she, is all this coming from? She hates me. She doesn't like me. No, she likes you. Don't say that. She likes you very much. Right from the first day I showed her your picture. When you marry her, you love her more. No. <laughs> I can't believe you're saying this, lady. You see, you're the first in my life. And I'll always love you first. I want you to know that, okay? 
Okay. Okay, baby. <laughs> ah. She doesn't seem to be comfortable around me. She just met you a few days ago for crying out loud. She's not used to you. But she warmed up to me the first day I got here. <laughs> Anyways, kids these days are like that. Mm -hmm. I just hope she comes around because I really do like her. Well, I think you should give it time. I will. Thank you. You're welcome. doesn't seem to like me. It's like she's afraid of me. I don't think so. I think you're just overthinking. So welcome to the first day you came to this house, right? Babe, I know. But it's like she's withdrawing from me. She doesn't want to give us room to bond. Probably she's still trying to get used to you. Give her some time. She's a kid. She'll come around. I just want to be close to her the way she is with her nanny. I know. But those two have come a very long way. Hmm? So with time, she'll get used to you. And will not be in need of a nanny. Not anymore. It's a cherub. <laughs> Oops. Oops. I'm sorry. I forgot to knock. You forgot to knock? Really? What do you want? I came to inform you that dinner is served, sir. Dinner is served? I thought I told you not to go to the stress of making... We're coming down soon for dinner. Thank you. <laughs> Me, take it easy on her. I know she's been helpful so far. Did I say something wrong? Mm. But she's hot. So what? She didn't knock. What if we were naked? <laughs> then we wouldn't have left the door open. Ah, yes, because I'm an expert. Give me a look. Give me a look. Give Come on, darling. Come, come, come. Come. 
Yeah, you can see it's old already. So why don't you go and meet your nanny and tell her to lose it for you so you can see that. No, no, baby. Come on, dear. Let me do it for you, okay? I got to it again. But she says she's going to do it for you. Why don't you allow her to do it? Come, sweetheart. Let her do it for you, okay? Come, baby. Sit. Sit. Good, good morning. Good morning, Oge. Okay. Good morning, dear. Oh, thank you, thank you. I'll pick you from there. Lily? Oh, no, 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 dear. Um, I'm already doing it. Don't worry, okay? But... But she says she's going to do it. So just allow her. It helps ease your work. I noticed you were angry back there. Yes, of course. I am angry. Why are you trying to deprive me of my job? Why am I in this house if you wouldn't let me do my job? Oh, no, 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 no. Don't say it that way. I'm only trying to create a bond with Lily. And you know, it's in these little things that I can't do that. I'm sorry, okay? You know, I know you like her a lot. Um, but I just need a chance to get close to her. And in fact, that's why I've come to talk to you. Oh. You know, maybe you can help me to know her likes and dislikes. And um, her birthday, Kelly said it's this month. But I can't seem to remember if he said it's on the night or night end. Well, her birthday's on the 19th. Oh, great. I would like to give her a surprise gift. And um, I'll be glad if you have any suggestions. Well, I'll think of something and get back to you. Hmm. All right then. Thank you very much, okay? Um, sorry. Okay. I would like to know, why are you stressing yourself so much just to please a child? Oh, <laughs> love. Hmm. You know, I love Kelly a lot. Mm. And I also love his daughter equally. Mm -mm. So I would just like to get to know her. So interesting. Mm. So thank you once again. Mm. Oh! I wish I could just strangle her. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, happy birthday. 
Happy birthday, my baby girl. Here. Wow. You love it? Thank you so much, Auntie Oge. Mm, you're welcome. <laughs> I'm glad you love it. So tell me, what do we do today? I'm sure my dad has something planned for me for my birthday. He always shows a surprise party for me every year. Oh, I'm so sorry. Not this year. Yes. I mean, I don't think that he remembers your birthday this year. Why would he even, when Matilda has all his attention? We well, don't never forget my birthday. Oh, it's okay. Don't cry. Don't cry, okay? I'm sure that he means well for you. It's just that lady. I told you she's mean. She doesn't care about you at all. She made him forget. I don't like her. Me neither. I don't like her. What? What? Why don't you go show daddy what Auntie Yoga got for you on your birthday? Okay. Go show daddy. Sweetheart, why are you up so early? What are you doing with a teddy bear? It's Uge bought it for me for my birthday. Forgot my birthday, the. Oh my god! Sweetheart, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, baby. I'm so sorry, darling. Oh my god, how could I have forgotten? I'm so sorry, okay? I'm so sorry, Lily. Actually, I thought your birthday was on the 19th. You know what? Why don't you go and meet your nanny and get dressed? I promise to take you anywhere of your choice. For real? For real, darling. Can Auntie Oge come meet us? Yeah, sure. Why not? That shouldn't be a problem. Thanks, Daddy. You're welcome, darling. Hmm? I'm so sorry. Happy birthday. Actually, it was her birthday is on the 19th. I was really planning on surprising her. But, but I told you. I forgot. I too forgot. I can't believe I forgot my daughter's birthday. Oh my God, this work is stressing me up. I must confess. I literally just ruined the chance of me getting close to her. Ready? Come on. <laughs> Beat yourself up. I too forgot. It happens at times, you know? It's not the same. Yeah, the truth is, I forgot too. I'm very sure Lily has forgotten about it. Come on, cheer yourself up. Is there anything? <laughs> Glad you did, my love. I want you to know that dad is doing anything to make her happy. Okay? Happy birthday. <laughs> I will join you shortly, babe. Okay, okay. Are you avoiding me? I've been trying to talk to you all day. Okay, what is it? Why did you lie to me? Why did you lie that her birthday is on the 19th? When it's actually on the 9th?
Did I? Well, I told you her birthday is on the night. I'm sorry if you didn't hear me clearly. She almost hates me. She was angry and got you a present on your birthday. She thinks you're a sports brat who deserves nothing on her birthday. I'm not a sports brat. Don't shout. She may hear you and I may lose my job. Should I tell daddy? No, 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 no. No, no. You made me a pinky promise, right? You promise not to tell daddy. So please, would you not tell daddy? Okay. <laughs> I don't know why she hates me. She hates me so much. Don't cry. She nearly slept me. Don't cry. <laughs> she said I'm always pampering you. You don't deserve such. You know what? Let me get you to the bathroom so you can shower and then I put you to bed, okay? Okay, I love you. I <sighs> love you too. I love you so much. <laughs> really? Are you okay? Baby, have you been crying? Are you crying? What is wrong? Lady, please talk to me. What is wrong with you? We don't like her to Matilda. I want her out of our house. You don't like Auntie Matilda? And you want her out of the house? But what did she do to you? Did she do something wrong? Or is it because she forgot your birthday? Is that why you want her out? Okay. Stop crying, okay? It's just not good to start your Monday with crying. Okay? Just stop it. I heard you. Babe, babe, are you okay? Does it work? Lady doesn't seem to like you. She was crying this morning. Seriously. What did you do to her? Nothing. I would never do anything to hurt your child. I love her that much. Are you sure? But I've never seen her like that before. Not even when her mother passed. <sighs> Babe, I think it's high time I have a conversation with you. No. No. That wouldn't be the best idea. You should have seen her this morning. I think, uh, give us some time. 
In other words, I... Yeah, just give her some time. We can't talk to her now. Perhaps, uh... Just give us a space. Are you asking me to leave? No, I'm not asking you to leave. I'm just saying that we need some time out. Just a space. And I'll tell you exactly when to return. Lily, baby. Lily. Lily. Lily, baby. Sweetheart, get up. Lily. Lily. Sweetheart, Lily. 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 What's going on here? I want to get her ready for school today. And why? That's my job, not yours. Mm-hmm. But that's because initially there was nobody to do it. And what's wrong if I want to get the kid ready sometimes? Remember, I'm gonna be her mom's son. Mm -hmm. Hey. Lily, your guiding angel is here. Wakey, wakey. Wakey, wakey. Did you sleep well? You did, right? So, Lily. Auntie. Matilda here said she wants to get you ready for school. Do you want her to? No. <laughs> you see? Maybe next time. So, Lily, let's go get you ready for school. <laughs> I'm coming. A word of advice. If the little girl does not like you, I think you should leave. It clearly proves that you have absolutely no space in this house. You see that man? He would put his daughter first before anyone else. What if your daughter's nanny has a hand in all that's happening? I... <clears throat> I don't understand. 
I mean, what if she's the reason Lily doesn't like me? Lily listens to her a lot. So it's possible she's telling her stuff. Stuff like what? Hmm? I don't know. I don't even know what to think anymore. But I do know children don't just wake up and start hating someone. Maybe there has to be a reason for that. I don't think Oge has done anything wrong, okay? It just doesn't make sense. <laughs> don't you see how she reacts when I try to get close to Lily? It's more like she's preventing me. <clears throat> Sweetheart. Baby, I think you are taking this too far. It would be so unfair to Ogi if all these accusations are wrong. Ogi has been doing extremely well in taking care of Lady for a long time now. Babe, let her go on the break. Sir, you sent for me. Yeah. <clears throat> Here. That's your salary. But why? It's not month end yet. I know. I'm giving you two weeks off. Your salary should have been a week from now. I decided to give it to you earlier because I know you have pressing needs. I knew it. You knew it? You knew what? I knew she was going to make you do this. What are you talking about? I overheard her conversation with someone on the phone, a man. She saw me and I think she's feeling guilty and probably thinks I would let you know about it. Hence, she decided to get me away. What was she telling the person? So don't worry, I'll just go and enjoy my two weeks break. It's, it's really fine, honestly. It's, it's, it's fine, sir. Listen to me, I'm talking to you. What was she telling the person on the phone? Um, she, she was telling him, sir, she's your girlfriend. I, don't worry, I, I, I don't want to talk, talk bad but about her. I need to hear every bit of it. What was she telling the person on the phone? <sighs> okay. Um, she was telling him how she's Tired of coping with your brat's excesses. What? She called my daughter that? Yes. She even told him she, she knows she never wanted to do this, but he's the one making her do it because she doesn't want to have anything to do with a single father. I think they just want money from you, sir. Matilda said all that? <sighs> Why didn't you tell me? Why didn't you tell me all this while? Why keep such an information away from me? Why? Matata! 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 I told you from the onset that I was a single father, right? 
And I needed a woman who would love my child as much as I do. Baby, what's going on? Why? Why didn't you come clean? Why? You should have told me you wanted nothing to do with a single father. You should have said it to my face. Baby, what are you talking about? You're getting me confused. Who have you been speaking with on the phone? Answer me. Who have you been speaking with on the phone? Baby, what are you talking about? I haven't been speaking with anyone. What do I expect? Nothing than denial. I can't believe you. Why? Why deceive me? Why? I thought you loved my daughter. I thought you loved my daughter. I told her I wanted to marry you. Kelly. Kelly, I love her. I really do. Sir. She doesn't love me. She hates me. You're right all along, darling. All along. She told you. It's her, right? She did this. She said these things to you. Matilda, leave my house. Leave my house now. And I mean it. I want you to pack your things and you're leaving like now. Lily, darling, can I ask you a question? I can't, Eddie. You are very glad Auntie Matilda has left the house, right? Yes. Okay. So, don't you want another mommy? We have a mommy, but Dad said that she's in heaven. She's dead. I mean, another mommy. A wife for your dad. I'm talking about someone to replace Auntie Matilda to be a close friend to your daddy. Okay. Now, why don't you go to daddy and tell him just how much you love Auntie Oge and would want for her to be your mommy? But you're my guardian angel. Why are you so daft? <sighs> sorry. I'm sorry I yelled at you, okay? Is your mind far away again? Not that. Just that I'm angry you're not very smart. Okay. I can be your mommy and your guardian angel too. So tell me. Don't you want a baby sister? Good. Now that is why I am here. To give you a baby sister. Okay? Good girl. So let's get going. Okay? I'll take her to school. <clears throat> yeah, no, no, I'm, I'm sure you, you can't do that today. I'll take her to school, okay? <laughs> Don't worry. <sighs> I'll be back shortly. <sighs> yeah, That's you, what is wrong with my dad? <laughs> Don't worry, he's fine. I, I think you should just... Oh. But he's supposed to take me to <sighs> school and go to work. <sighs> Mm. 
Yes. I'll be back. We're supposed to drop me at school. I said he's fine. Let's get you to school. You ask a lot of questions. You're my fantasy, Mr. Perfect for me. I'm gonna do all it takes to make you mine. And I am ready to put up a fight. If that is what it takes to make you mine, it's the craziest kind of attraction. Yeah. Overwhelming, that's just how it feels. I know they lie, heaven knows you're my perfect distraction. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Wish you knew that you are my obsession. Feel my heart beat, you know that it's real. Though it feels like it's only in my imagination. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Love can start a war. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you wanna bring it on? No, no, no. If I cannot have you, yeah, yeah, yeah. No one ever will. No, no, no. Cause I'm crazy for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't really care. No, no, no. If I cannot have you, yeah, yeah, yeah. No one ever will. Love can start a war. Love can start a war. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, Do you wanna bring it on? No, no, no. If I cannot have you, yeah, yeah, yeah. No one ever will. No, no, no. Cause I'm crazy for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't really care. No, no, no. If I cannot have you, yeah, yeah, yeah. No one ever will. No, no, no. No, no, no. You're my fantasy, Mr. Perfect for me. I'm gonna do all it takes to make you mine. And I am ready to put up a fight. If that is what it takes to make you mine, it's the craziest kind of attraction. Yeah. Overwhelming, that's just how it feels. I know they lie, heaven knows you're my perfect distraction. Yeah. Yes. Okay, now stand. I want to love that talk. Eh? He's sleeping. I'm in the kitchen. Now wow. Hello. Hello. You're my fantasy, Mr. Perfect for me. I'm gonna do all it takes to make you mine And I am ready to put up a fight If that is what it takes to make you mine It's the craziest kind of attraction yeah. Overwhelming, that's just how it feels I know they lie, heaven knows you're my perfect distraction Yeah, yeah, yeah Wish you knew that you are my obsession Feel my heart beat, you know that it's real Though it feels like it's only in my imagination Yeah, yeah, yeah Love can start a war Yeah, yeah, yeah Do you wanna bring it on? No, no, no If I cannot have you Yeah, yeah, yeah No one ever will No, no, no Cause I'm crazy for you Yeah, yeah, yeah I don't really care No, no, no if I cannot have you, yeah, 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 no one ever will. Love no, no, can start a no, war. No. Love can start a war. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no. Do you wanna bring it up? No, no, no. If I can't have you, yeah, yeah, yeah. Trying to get you to bed. No, no, no. Cause I'm crazy. You can't be sleeping here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't really care. No, no. If I cannot have you, yeah, yeah. No one ever will. No, no. I can't believe you woke up so early to drink yourself to stupor because of that girl. 
You're my fantasy, Mr. Perfect for me. I'm gonna do all it takes to make you mine. And I am ready to put up a fight. If that is what it takes to make you mine, it's the craziest kind of attraction. Yeah. Overwhelming, that's uh. just how it feels. Uh. I know that light has a uh. You're my perfect distraction Yeah, yeah, yeah I wish you knew that you are my obsession Feel my heart beat, you know that it's real Though it feels like it's only in my imagination Yeah, yeah, yeah Love can start a war Yeah, yeah, yeah Do you wanna bring it on? No, no, no If I cannot have you Yeah, yeah, yeah No one ever will No, no, no Cause I'm crazy for you yeah, 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 I don't really care No, 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 if I cannot have you Yeah, 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 no one ever will no, Love can start a war, love can start a war Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah Oh, that's perfect Oh, stop Stop it Oh, You're my oh, fantasy, make oh. perfect for me. Yes, I'm oh. going to do all oh. it takes to oh. make you mine. Oh. And oh. I am ready. Oh. To oh. to me. I don't oh. to me. Oh. Do stop. Stop it. I love you. Please make love to me. No. Make love to me. I, I love you. No. Oh. I love you so much. No. I'll take care of you, okay? I love you really so much. I want you. I want you so bad. Okay. Oh. You love it. Um, Trust me, you're going to enjoy it. I, I love you so much. Would you just stop it? Just, just, just stop it. I love you. I said I love you. I love you. No, no, no. If I cannot have you, yeah, yeah, yeah. No one ever will. Love is not a war. Love is not a war. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, come on. Listen, I know you want it too. I do not want. Listen, I know you want me. I know you love me too. You want it so bad, like I do, right? I know. I am in love with I'm a toga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you wanna bring it on? No, no, no. If I ever had you, yeah, yeah, yeah. No one ever will. No, no, no. Cause I'm crazy for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't really care. No, no, no. If I cannot have you, yeah, yeah, yeah. No one ever will. Left this down the You don't even know what you want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bring it on. No, no, no. If I cannot have you, yeah, yeah, yeah. No one. Loser. Loser. Mm -hmm. Go upstairs and take your uniform off. Will you help me do it? Are you a baby? Can't you take your uniform off by yourself? Must I do everything for you? Must I? Go take your uniform off.
You're awake, sir. Yeah. Where is Lady? Oh, she's in her room. She just got back from school. Let me go help her. No. What happened back there? Where? Oh, you. I, when I took you to your room to sleep, yeah, I helped you to the bedroom to sleep. You were muttering to yourself. I think you were hallucinating. Yes, sir. Oh. Okay. Yes, sir. Miss her too, you know. It's obvious that no one can take her place. <sighs> I thought Matilda was the one. Tell her I didn't go to work yesterday. Let her not bother you, sweetheart. She doesn't want it. Dad, can I ask you a question? Yeah. Go ahead. Can your guide your angel be like you and treat you harshly? <laughs> no, darling. Our guardian angels don't treat us harshly. They protect and guard us instead. What do you ask? Yes, <laughs> Dad. Are you sure? Okay, then I, I will leave you with your money to do your assignment, okay? Be good. <laughs> Lily, okay, so... What were you trying to do? Hmm? Leave me alone! Are you, are you shouting at me? Huh? What am I doing? What am I doing anything? You wouldn't even dare. Oh, listen. You made me a promise. And any... And anyone who makes a promise and fails will die. But you think I'm joking? Go and tell me And why are you crying? Did I beat you? I didn't even touch you. Look. 
I'm just telling you the simple truth. You know why? Because I love you. You said that you love me, but you treat me harshly. You said that Auntie Matilda hates me, but she had never shouted at me before. But well, shut up! Shut up. You better behave yourself. Else, I will deal with you somewhere else, Matilda. So this is what you've been doing to my daughter? Huh? You act like an angel while you're a devil in disguise? You are the devil! You ungrateful man! What do I not do for you? I cook, I clean, I take care of your daughter and you! I, I don't put on seductive words for you to notice me but you don't! What is it? I'm tired. I am tired. You have a beautiful woman like me in your house. Yet you go out to bring that stupid Matilda. I can clearly see that you're going nuts. You've gone nuts. Why should I be looking at you? Why? You're my employee, my daughter's nanny. Oh, please, and so what? So then what? What, 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 what does she have? Matilda, is she of same class with you? Listen to me, my young lady. I'm a principal to man. I don't have affairs with my employee. Do you understand me? Besides, you are not attractive. I don't have one feelings for you. Not to hell with you. I'm not letting you go. <laughs> not anywhere. For messing with my child's heads. You need to spend the rest of your life behind bars. I'm sorry. Sorry, I'm, I'm sorry, please. Please, I'm sorry. I, I don't know what came up with me. I, I, don't, I don't know what happened. I let my feelings take the better part of me. Please forgive me. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, please. It's because I love you. I love you so much. I've loved you from the day I set my eyes on you. I'm sorry, please. I'm sorry, it's love. This is what love makes us do. I'm sorry, please. You're disgusting. <laughs> no, 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 don't touch my daughter. And just stop all this crocodile's tears. It just doesn't make sense. You are only infatuated with me. Ma, Matilda was innocent after all. <laughs> I'm sorry, please. Okay, Oge lied to me. Yes, darling. Not just you, she lied to all of us. But can, can we not hold that against her anymore? <laughs> that would not be possible. She messed up with your head. She lied against Aunt Matilda. And her punishment is unforgivable. But air is human. To forgive is divine. My teacher says it's good to let go of the burden inside of our hearts for the peace inside of us. So are you saying you want us to forgive her? Mm-hmm. Really? Yes. Okay. If that's what you want. Thank you, Daddy. You're welcome. My little girl has grown. <laughs> I want you. 
<laughs> I hate it. <laughs> but I did. I, I want you. <laughs> I want you. <laughs> You have, you have now realized that whatever I was telling you is the truth, you know? <laughs> At least you have realized your mistake. <laughs> calm down, calm down. <laughs> you, will, you will get a better job, oh. The Lord will serve. <laughs> Ibi, uh, where are you now? I can't, I can't, where are you? Can you just come, like sh wave your hand or something? Let me see, I literally can't find you anywhere. Are you kidding me? I can't. I'm serious. Where are you? Stop joking with me. You be seriously. Okay. Now you're getting on my nerves. You be where are you now? Stop being annoying. Where? Behind me? I'm sorry. You're sorry? You are sorry. I thought you said I should leave your house. But not my life. It doesn't matter. I'm sorry. No, sweetheart. You didn't do anything to me. I can't wait for you to be the mother of my children. You marry me. <laughs> yes. Feel my 
my heart made you know that it's real Though it feels like it's only in my imagination Yeah, yeah You're my fantasy, Mr. Perfect for me I'm gon' do all it takes to make you mine And I am ready to put up a fight If that is what it takes to make you mine It's the craziest kind of attraction Overwhelming is just how it feels I know that light heaven knows you're my perfect distraction Love can start a war, yeah, yeah, yeah Do you wanna bring it on? No, no, 